What's up guys and welcome to episode 4 of reading your comments. So as you know, if you have any comments that you would like me to read, questions you want to ask, anything like that, leave them in this video. I take questions and comments from this video first, and then I fill it out with comments and questions from other videos. So, well, let's get into it. I have two questions for you that I'm curious about and I didn't know. Are you married and how old are you? Yes, I am married. Me and Tracy got married November 13th of 2015. This year will be two years that we were married. We got married on Friday the 13th, strangely, and uh, it's working out great. Happily married. It is awesome. As far as how old I am, I am at 29, September 7th of 2017. I will be 30. Found your channel from your GameStop rant. I would love it if you did a story time type of video. Love your channel, 12 of 10, would watch again. That's awesome, I'm glad that you enjoy it. As far as story time video goes, um, I do have a couple of things that I could talk about. Um, I'm just saving them. Basically, I save story times for like, if I have like a super busy day planned and it's not really vlog friendly, then I will do a story time or something like that, which is actually kind of what happened on the GameStop video. Um, so yeah, I've got a couple things. Definitely will do that. Keep that in mind. Um, and if it's a, like a boring day or something like that, I will definitely do that. And uh, I hope you enjoy. Thank you for the comment. Been super busy lately, so I've missed a couple of vlogs and I need to catch up. But my question is, what games are you most excited for this autumn? Um, this autumn, I will, I, I'm, honestly, I don't really play a lot. The main thing that I'd be looking for would be the NBA 2K game. Like, I love that. As far as that, I'm not really 100% sure of what else comes out. I think God of War is next year. Red Dead Redemption uh, 2, I think, is next year. Uh, Kingdom Hearts is probably never, but they're saying next year. So there's a couple things I'm looking forward to then. But other than that, I'm not really sure. Uh, will you be doing SummerSlam predictions? I did do SummerSlam pr slam predictions. Hopefully you saw that and I hope you enjoyed I'm confused. Are you fatter than you appear? You don't look like a fat guy. You're so, you look somewhere between 180 and 200. I shoot flatteringly. Flatteringly. Uh, yes, no, I'm a super fat dude. 253 pounds uh, working on losing that. So, yes, I actually am. I'm a pretty big dude. Two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. All right. Uh, oh, tons of questions. All right. What is your favorite color? Favorite color is blue. What is your favorite superhero? Green Lantern is my favorite superhero. Um, that was the first one that I was really attracted to while when I started reading comics. Um, so I'm going to say that one. Uh, things that I've read recently and I really, really enjoy as far as superhero goes. I think The Punisher, um, especially this 1986 series I'm reading right now is just brutally amazing. And other than that, I've actually, I've never disliked Spider-Man, but he's never been my favorite. But after reading Superior Spider-Man, what I have read of it so far, even though it's not Peter Parker, it's Doc Ock, but uh, I really, really love Spider-Man. Uh, will you ever cut your beard fully? Sure, depends. Uh, maybe we can make that a milestone for subscribers or something. How does Tracy feel about your vlogs? Tracy is very supportive, but she is kind of ambivalent about it. I'm sure that she would love to have days where I don't film, but uh, she's very supportive, and that's that's what matters. You don't like any shows that are recent. Um, Superstore. I love Superstore. I think that's a great show. Have you ever heard of Suicide Boys? I have not. How old are all three of you? They don't have to answer this one. I'm not going to tell Tracy's age, because uh, she'll kill me. Uh, she's not, like, old or anything, but yeah, that's just something. Um, Noah is nine months old, and I am 20. Nine. Would you ever go to Six Flags? I've been to Six Flags. I've been to a Six Flags in Atlanta because my sister lives down there. Hi, Heather. And uh, I've been to a Six Flags in Houston because one of my best friends, Jeff, lives outside of Houston. I don't know if Jeff watches, but if he does, hi, Jeff. So, yeah. What's your favorite car type of car? I'm not a car person. Never have been a car person, so I don't have a particular car that I would love. Um, yeah, I, I don't. The only thing that really stands out to me is the Nissan Skyline, and that's specifically because of playing Need for Speed Underground. So I'm going to say that. Also, I'll watch your full videos when I'm high, so interesting. <laughs> well, I'm not sure if that's good or not as far as it takes you being high to appreciate me, but I appreciate that. Thank you so much for the comment. Where do you work? Uh, I don't say the place that I work at, but basically I deal with spreadsheets and stuff like that. So that's what I do. You need to add Be A Small Santa to an overall bucket list because when you get old, you would be the best Santa. That's the greatest comment. That, I might frame that comment. That's amazing. Maybe. Um, if I let my beard grow out and dye it gray or just as it naturally turns gray, I don't know if you can see it or not in the camera, but I am getting gray hair, and I know there's some gray beard hair in there that I guess comes with the aging process, but that is hilarious. I will consider it. Hopefully I'll still be vlogging by then. Maybe not. I don't know. 20 years worth of vlogs? Does that work for people? I don't know. 
Dude always thought I was younger, but I am 31. I always thought you were younger than me, also, just from interactions and games. I'm not saying you act young, but I just always assumed that you were. I'd like to see you do a prank on anyone before you turn 30. That is something I would like to do, but I don't know if it's feasible. I will keep that in mind, though. Maybe that is something I can do. Um, I'll just say I wouldn't be opposed to it. No, no, it's adorable. I miss my grandbabies at his age. Thank you so much. Um, I feel like as I get older, uh, I mean, it's already hitting hard. Like, I was looking at pictures of him the other day, and I was like, he's a completely different kid than he was, like, even six months ago. Like, he looks different. He obviously acts different because he's growing, but uh, I feel like I'm really going to miss this, too. And that's part of why I do the vlogs is because of being able to go back and, and watch him as he grows. So I appreciate that. Thank you. Please don't stop your videos. I love them. Um, I'm not gonna stop. I get really irritated with YouTube and their constant censoring of things, especially on a family-friendly channel. Like, I don't curse. I don't think I've ever cursed on this channel. And I think even when I have other people in my vlogs and they curse, I think I even edit those out. And then I don't talk about conflict or controversial topics. Like, I don't talk about anything political or anything like that because again of well of the controversies and and it's something that's just it's a it's not none of anybody's business but b all it does is tear people apart i don't know anybody who's been like hey let's talk about politics and like grown to be better friends so there's no point in putting any of that in so i, I don't understand what they do and it, and it does frustrate me that you know again that without the monet the monetization on it it prevents your videos from being seen which prevents you from growing which is kind of making this all for naught Although it's not really because I do it for Noah, but you know what I mean? It is frustrating, but don't worry. I'm not going to stop. I'm here. I've done this 440 days in a row, and I promise it's not stopping. I don't think I've ever seen anyone microwave an egg before. All right, this is, uh, it's, it's, it's honestly the way, I'm not a big egg fan. Let me just start out by saying that. I'm not a big egg fan. Even when it's scrambled, I can take it or leave it. Omelets are generally okay. Um, and, and the thing is, if eggs are fixed, I'm perfectly fine with it. When I went to my buddy Madison's the other day and it was his birthday, his mom made gravy and biscuits and eggs. Loved it. It was delicious. Eggs aren't something I seek out. How about that? Is that what we'll say? Um, but this is the way that when I would grow up and I would eat egg sandwiches, this is how my mom always made them, and that's just where I got that from. I don't know anybody else that does it either. I don't know where she got it from. I probably could ask her. But, uh, yeah, if you've never tried it like that, I'm telling you, put it in a glass bowl, crack the egg, put it in there, 22 seconds, covered. 22 seconds again as soon as it's done no idea why you have to stop it but you do and it makes it really really awesome i really really like it that's terrific your wife getting closer to normal ankle function yeah man i appreciate that also you guys uh harry is an additional youtuber 178 subscribers according to this screen cap that i have right here go check him out he does some vlogs and stuff not every day but he does like toy hunting and stuff very very cool channel harry's a very very good guy i love him uh but um yeah it's great she is recovering very very well um, she actually took some steps today. This was going to be in the vlog, but then I decided to do this. Um, but she took some steps without her boots and stuff today, which may be in tomorrow's vlog. So, But she is recovering. Uh, we've been blessed, and uh, it's, it's still a little bit of a long road to recovery, but we are making it, and we're getting through it. Why do you live in my city? No idea, man, but Bluefield is where I was born and raised, so I hope that's a good thing. I don't know, um, but I appreciate you checking out my channel. Today is my birthday too, you have a nice family. I appreciate that, thank you so much, and happy late, this was six days ago, so happy six days ago birthday, happy belated birthday. Thank you for watching, and uh, thank you for the comment. Tacos are life, but I would rather eat nacho. Pablo is a great cat, so it's Vincent. Thank you, uh, I appreciate that. And I will say this, I agree with that statement. I love tacos, but nachos, man, I could eat nachos all the time, and it doesn't matter what it is, like, um, I can eat just plain cheese nachos. I love nachos with chorizo. I love nachos with chicken. I love nachos with steak. Obviously, when I'm not doing like my vegetarian eating routine, uh, Portobello, uh, not Portobello, is that, that is a restaurant around here, but uh, Savory Flavors around here has an awesome barbecue nachos, which I've showed in the vlog before. I love nachos. There's Irish nachos around here, which is like pita chips and like chicken and Alfredo sauce. I love nachos, man. You throw some chips and a bunch of different crap on it. Not literally. I am going to eat it. It. Oh man, love nachos. I agree completely. Love the vlogs, but I keep hearing this grinding sound in all of them like a film rolling. Uh, I wanted to answer this, and I may actually answer this in another vlog, uh, maybe just in, to make sure the most people see it. Yes, I have an older camera. This camera I bought right after I started doing YouTube in 2015. February of 2015. February 8th, 2015. Um, this camera is old, and which is fine. It still works perfectly as far as picture quality. The problem is in low light settings, I didn't even think about it, but probably like this, 
So I hope it hadn't happened this entire video. There, it's basically the autofocus brightening and dimming the picture and it makes a cranking noise because I use the stock microphone on this camera because it's a point and shoot and I can't hook a microphone up to it. Plus I just don't have money to buy a microphone and a whole bunch of different things like that. But that is what you're hearing. It's the autofocus um, trying to focus the camera. Um, I'm trying to get better about shooting specifically in lighter situations. Obviously sometimes that can't happen. Uh, and I like to shoot with this and I would rather have this with a little bit of that grind versus shooting with my phone that pixelates really bad. So you gotta pick your battles. But that is what you're hearing. It is the autofocus trying to focus the camera. So, and I do apologize about that. Do you watch Game of Thrones? Game of Thrones, I do not watch. I have seen the first episode and I haven't watched it since. Um, I didn't watch it when it came on. I just, I, I don't have the time to do that, honestly, is the main reason. And I know it's an hour and a week, a week and you're probably like, oh, you watch four hours wrestling at a time when pay-per-views are on and stuff. But um, me and Tracy have talked about watching it. We just haven't just yet. Um, and again, mainly it's just, well, A, and it'll have HBO. But there, there's several different reasons. But no, I, I don't watch Game of Thrones. It seems like a fantastic show, but there's just other stuff that we watch. Um, like I said, we watch Superstore, and uh, and then we watch a bunch of shows like via Netflix or Hulu. So uh, that's kind of why we don't watch it. So maybe one day we'll do it, and then I'll talk about it. But as of right now, I do not watch Game of Thrones. You look like Jesus. Well, I appreciate that. Thank you. Uh, probably not as cool as Jesus, um, but uh, I do I do appreciate that. Thank you. So I guess thank you. Right? It's a good thing. So cool. Alright guys, and that is going to be it. I'm going to go into the living room, watch some Big Brother, eat some cereal, have an awesome day, edit this. Thank you guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget, leave comments down below if you want to see them in the next Reading Your Comments video. So thank you guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.